If someone has passed away and a picture is taken of the deceased person's face, is it permissible to keep this picture on your phone? Yeah, there's no harm in that. Our, we have, you know, wedding pictures and many of them, they die. Of those who were present in the wedding. So you don't destroy the wedding pictures you have in your albums. So it's allowed, inshallah. There's no harm. And the only thing which is not permissible in Islam is that whenever, you know, the, that is something that Quran has mentioned. Uh, that this ayah says that when somebody passes uh, you know passed away and you get that news you say we are for Allah and we will go back to Allah that means you are pleased with whatever Allah has destined you are pleased with the qadr that Allah has put you in so that, that is different than having these pictures. Most of the time when you have pictures, you know, uh, and keep on watching, you may not be happy with what Allah has put the qadr in it. You are not happy why Allah has taken so and so person's death, life. So that way, that is something should be avoided because that's something you are going against the qadr that Allah has destined for this person. Also sometimes, you know, the jahiliya. In the past, the Arabs, when there's somebody dies in their family, they didn't have the cameras, but they would mention the whole life of this person and mourning in such a bad manner that it would, you know, feel that Allah has done zulm on them by taking the life of this person. So this could be sometimes, you know, happens uh, that uh, when people are having the pictures in their mobile and when, whenever they look at it, they start crying. They start missing them. They start mourning about them. So that should not be done.